What's up? It's uh, first trip of 2020, headed to southeast Oklahoma, the Lower Mountain Fork River. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be a good time. is up, camp is made, let's go fish. So we're back at camp. I'm gonna take off my waders and my wet boots, let these dry out. It's supposed to be down freezing tonight, so these probably freeze up and be solid tomorrow, so I'm gonna stick them by the fire. But, so yeah, see the, uh, it's a nice campground. You know, it's uh, no water or power, but I don't need it. I have a, that helps me charge my GoPro batteries and anything else I can charge my cell phone. Um, yeah, lots of trees, lots of shade. Set my hammock up, um, and honestly, from here you can walk to the catch and release area. I don't. I just usually drive over there, so I have all my stuff in my truck with me. I don't have to take it with me. But yeah, nice campgrounds. Nobody here. Middle of the week in the winter. Just the way I like it. So yeah, I'm gonna make some chili, drink a beer, uh, put some warm clothes on, and we'll see you guys a little bit later. Alright, so it's day two, slept in the hammock last night, had a pretty good night, um, didn't wake up till about 5.30. Coffee, breakfast, I am going to start here, it's about 6.45 in the morning, uh, the sun's just starting to get up, there's nobody here, which is important because this place tends to get uh, crowded, but uh, starting at the catch and release area, going to walk it, see if I see any, any fish that I can side cast. Um, after that, probably switch it up and try a couple other spots today, um, this, I expect it to get a little bit crowded. Um, it's just, you know, middle of the week, but even yesterday I got here about lunch and there were still four or five people here um, after I, I got here. So when that happens, I'll, uh, I'll venture, see what I can, see what I can find. But yeah, it's going to be a good day.
All right, here's the regulations. I pretty much practice catch and release and use barbless hooks, so I don't really pay much attention to this, but if, you, if you're coming for the first time, you probably want to check it out, make sure you're, you're legal. And that's it, browns and rainbows here. So that's all the time I have. Uh, just finished up the last day at Spillway Creek. Um, probably my favorite section of the river. Um, didn't see another person till the end there. Caught some fish, missed some fish. Um, my favorite spot, especially for if you only have like a half a day, but it's you know it's scenic and just reminds me of a regular trout water. So yeah, good times. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna be putting some more out. So talk to you guys later.